So today we're playing a character, I literally have no idea how they work. Excuse me, why can't I- WHAT?! Huh? <laughs> I don't understand. Okay, I, wait, I do understand. I get it, I get it, I get it. Uh, it looks like whenever I shoot, a knife falls down on me, and then when I press it again, it comes back towards me and that also deals damage. Okay, cool. I have no idea about this character, it was just suggested to me, and I was like, you know what? Short, it sounds sick. We have an eternal heart over there, let's go for it. Looks like the initial fall down on the sword gives you a bit of, uh, tear effects. So maybe they'll work with other tier effects. Sprinkler, that is hilarious uh, in terms of thematics. I don't, I don't think it, it will do anything. I mean, I might as well take it, right? I wonder, if the sword falls down, right? I mean, does, does that do damage on top of the fact that the tears come out? Wait a second. Let me get real close. Okay, definitely, right? 100%. Like, I didn't just imagine that. Okay, seems like a cool character. I'm interested. I think for single target enemies like these, these maws, or I guess they're called horfs, right? Horf! They're called horfs. Uh, they're a little bit harder to deal with. That definitely has confirmed that we do uh, big damage on the sword, by the way. But in terms of big horde enemies, like I, I place down the sword, right? And then probably go to the other side of the room and go, haha, spiders? Yeah, right, idiots. I don't really know what this character synergies are, but we will find out, hopefully. And uh, as per usual, if we don't have Wait, I broke a rock? Wait, this guy is broken if he can break rocks. That's not okay. How did I do that? What? Oh my god. Oh wait, the recall breaks rocks? This character is busted. This character is broken because they have infinite crawl spaces, potentially, right? This could also just be wrong, but I mean, it seems like this breaking rocks. I don't think it would break open secret rooms. That seems too broken for me. Boom. Oh yeah, that's that's big. <laughs> Wait, hold on. I mean, uh, maybe if I'm lucky, there's a key in here. Oh, all right, definitely not the case. I think I'll just go. Wow, that sucks, man. You're gonna give me a, a library just sitting there? It's all right. Well, I, I take my L. All right, we'll pop down the sprinkler. Uh, he will definitely go hard by shooting 3.5 damage tears every now and then. Thanks, dude. Ah! I can see the challenge in the character now. Also, this is a terrible layout for this character. Is that just me? Like, the, the, the floating enemy with the gaps on the first floor is not okay. Why are you doing this to me? Turns out this character is challenging. Today I learned, oh my god, I'm about to die. Maybe I should just be spamming it. Maybe this is the way you play the character. Less recall, more tears everywhere. I- wait, this might actually be the strat. Obviously there's a bit of strategy involved, right? I need to aim my sword correctly, but I'm realizing that's probably the better way to go about it. Okay, we learned the playstyle with the character, at least a more effective one. That is a scared heart, get back here. You live and you learn, and now we learned a better playstyle, let's go. No keys still, so we can't go treasure room. I have found envy. That's not what I was expecting. Cool. What's up? Okay, the damage is large if you can get the recall in play. It's just a little bit tough. Maybe it's skill issue, not sure. Shoot the whoop will make it so I have more condensed, consistent damage. So we're taking this instead. You shoop. Shoop scales with your damage as far as I know. So the more damage you get, the better it'll be. And it's definitely being effective right now. I mean, look at the damage that it already did. If I can get the sword to drop right on Monstro, the damage is high. It's more just like... It's kind of hard to do. <laughs> Get rid of this mulligan. I don't need you here. Nice. Safety pin. Sure. I know Brim has uh, a synergy. Uh, likely that I find Brim is low, but I gotta go for it. Book of Belial. Is it weird that I prefer a Shoop to Whoop here? I'm definitely not taking Shoop, by the way. Like, even if I think I prefer it, Belial's too broken. Uh, did I seriously go through an entire floor again? No key moment, huh? Wow, we we are not making it out of the basement here. Hold on, wait, what? Maybe another secret room play? But even then, I mean, you gotta give me some keys. We go planetariums, probably. Oh! Ooh. Wow, rip my black heart. The one thing that I liked. Okay. Is a black heart worth a crawl space? Yeah, uh, eh, yeah, sure. Actually, it's worth even more because I gotta go back and take my Belial. It's okay. Hopefully, this is the god crawl space that gives me a key and then I manage to go to the treasure room, which has Polyphemus. Not the case. In fact, I'm about to die. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Give me the leech. I, leech was cool. At least I get an item for the floor, right? Hearts? It's terrible. But maybe I can find someone here. That's not the case. But that is also why we have the child's heart trinket. So we can make plays. Hopefully I can survive the caves. Usually I'd be like, <laughs> what? Caves? Who cares? Uh, I am a different character that has a completely different play style. I'm terrified. Especially of this room. Oh. Did I just get healed? Leech! Leech the god! Thank you! I forgot what Leech even does. <laughs> 
Wait, Leech goaded? For real? Rip my deal chance? It's okay. I'll just have Leech go crazy again. The uh, reason I took Belial is just because I figured the extra deal chance will be nice for us. Black Heartians. Nice. Wonderful. Would you believe if I said I still don't have keys? <laughs> uh, there's actually a secret passive for this character where you're not allowed to have keys until you complain about it enough and then it drops the moment you start making a joke about it. Thanks for the Mega Blast. Effectively ruining the joke entirely. Yeah, you know how it is. I do like the sound it makes. Like, hoing. <laughs> okay, don't put that. <laughs> Top 10 worst sound effects on the Lazy Man Man channel. Number, number like three. That one's up there. Leech is not having a good time. He, he, he is fiending right now. Bro is ready to chow down. <laughs> he is so damn hungry. This is one of those enemies where I feel like just spamming the sword just does better than trying to get the recall off. I, I actually like this character a lot because I'm realizing it's not one strategy for, for any enemies, right? Like I, I thought, oh, recall is better. And then for a second I thought spamming would be better. But I'm realizing uh, each enemy you come across probably has a better way of dealing with them with both variants. Like you have to kind of decide on the go. And that's really cool. You get to uh, fight enemies in different play styles depending on what you like. I feel like this could be secret room and it also has two mushrooms, so go for it. I'm correct. Oh, I mean, I could. I, oh, hmm, do I? Yeah, I've, I? At this rate, with how the run's going, it seems like I probably should. Uh, well, yeah, that's interesting. Also kind of interesting the fact that I managed to get two uh, secret room items back to back. They were both kind of poo-poo, but it was nice that it showed up. I might just do it. We don't have missing though a lot. Me, but the sword versus the wretched. <laughs> I will miss my Book of Belial, by the way. I have barely used it, but man, when it does come in clutch, it do be dealing damage. You gonna give me the 10%? Yeah. Oh! No way I managed to land that, actually. What? Hold on. Oh, it's it's awful. <laughs> you know what? We'll take you. Uh, just because this will give us a roll from Missing Note into the Devil Pool. And then I'll take Missing Note. Why not? Jacket. Syntax error. Duality. That, that would have been funny, but not the case. We have a planetarium chance so far. Uh, this roll does not matter whatsoever, by the way, because we get another roll when we go down here. Key bomb. Oof. Our stats went up, though, really nicely. Uh, Isaac's head. Honestly, with the fact that I no longer have any red hearts to give away, I should just do this. D4- Are you joking me? What is going on? <laughs> Is this, I mean, that's honestly not worth it. I reroll every single time anyway. I might as well keep Belial with me, right? Belial increases my deal chance, gives me damage. There's just no reason for me to abandon it, I don't think. Okay, when the sword hits, it does crazy damage. It, it does like offensive Damocles. I, I have Damocles, but on command. We have a free boss challenge room. It doesn't even have an HP up, but I'll do it. I mean, I have Belial ready. I have Judas for safety. I should be okay. I can't deny the amount of damage I really am doing. It's just kind of indirect damage. It's very scary. That's one thing about this character is I, I don't really have that much power over my damage. And when I do, I got to get real close. Could be secret below me. Hey, I got it right. Just this guy. This guy will give me a better deal chance. So he's worth the blow up. And then we'll go, I guess. Playing well, but I don't know for how much longer, right? There's only so long I can go without getting hit. So I hope I get soul hard soon. Oh wait, I just realized, Bozo, go to the curse room, we got it for free! Oh, that's that's beautiful. But don't worry, by doing this, I will actually spawn a soul heart for the room clear reward. That's a card? Oh yeah, that's cool. Ah, a key. Well, I begged for keys like a little baby, and then I eventually got them. Maybe if I begged for hearts long enough, and then I'll get an HP up right here, and then it'll get re-rolled. <laughs> Jesus! Okay. It's fine, don't worry about it. Okay, the damage is good on this character for real, hold on. Uh, yay! Look what happened, it's exactly what I said. Judas is shut up. I can't do that. That's mean. Oh, I'll take that though. Sure. Thank you. Uh, yeah, I can't do Judas' Shadow. That one it, it can entirely defeat the purpose. <laughs> give me Brimstone, give me Brimstone, give me Brimstone. Not Brimstone, but PJ's that does nothing. Thank you. Uh, as well as I have Belial, which is the coolest thing I've found so far. And it does work, which is cool. So this kind of makes me feel like I should be going more spammy mode on this floor. I'm just taking advantage of I have Belial, right? Devil, okay. <laughs> World's scariest thing. I should take advantage of that for this floor. I mean, it could have a dead cat. That could be my saving grace until I realize that I have Missing No. Missing No is beginning to look more and more like a bozo pick, but I, at the time it felt good. I just got to pull through and find more soul hearts, right? I mean, this, I feel like the giant props from the lamb constantly give bone hearts. 
So if I find bombs, I can do it. I have a tinted rock over there. It's very scary, but I managed to accidentally break it open. I will give all my bombs to this because I imagine the bone hearts will drop. Nice. And I think there was a heart up here. Nice. Okay, we are bringing it back. Let's go. All right, we actually have money for the shop, and the shop has money. <laughs> I mean, that's that's pure stocks and bonds right there, baby. I don't need piggy bank, though, thanks. I figure with uh, Missing No and ah the Belial uh, play that I made earlier, or not the Belial, sorry, I was thinking I Belial, uh, with the Devil Room play I made earlier where I basically picked up a Devil Room item for Missing No, I feel like I could probably get some kind of god item from uh, the Devil Room eventually, right? We found a library as well, which will give us Bookworm, potentially? I wonder how Bookworm works. Ooh, Cracked Door. Libarbi. Oh yeah, that's that's good stuff. I mean, I really want Book of Shadows, but Book of Belial is giving us way too much damage here. Wait, Book of Shadows would be goaded, no? Jesus, four out of three bookworm. I I'm a goddamn nerd. Uh, wow, I kind of want Book of Shadows because I'm realizing this character very much benefits from getting up close, right? This might be more effective uh, damage over time. I could be incorrect with my decision making here. I lose the old chance, but I think this could be better. Also, I will feel less uh, afraid of my life. Reprieve continues to be one of the easiest fights in the game. Thank you for existing. Blue cap is nice. More deals? Oh! Okay, I need to know how Twisted Pair works. Gimme, gimme. How does this work? I got conjoined as well. What is this? Does it work at all? Oh, they just shoot. Oh, I, I'm, I, I, I guess that makes sense. I guess I was assuming they were going to have like a little sword over them every single time. That would have been cool, but I, I understand that. That makes more sense. Too bad they're gone <laughs> for Monstro's lung. Does Monstro have a synergy? Oh my lord, he does. I shoot out a burst now. Every now and then? Interesting. They also have Flatstone along with this. We landed a dead cat, which is cool. No Guppy because we lost the other. Wait a second. We didn't lose all our Guppy items. We're actually 2-3. If I can find a Guppy item on this floor, we can manage to nab it. Why do I just have a feeling? Ha ha! Ho ho! Hee <laughs> hee! I will clear out the entire floor first before I use that solar cane, just to make sure maybe I know where it, uh, the ultra secret could be. Treasure! Golden Razor! Thanks for the five coins! I'm out of here! Goodbye! Do I have Book of Virtues? <laughs> How long did it take for me to realize that? What the hell? I just realized I had an angel chance. I was thinking, wait, that doesn't make any sense. Turns out there's a little book sprite be below my... Well, I guess there's a book sprite... There's a book sprite below my book sprite. Fanny pack. Yeah, I'll take it. I'm more just because I have items to roll, right? The more the merrier when you have missing no. This is beginning to look like a good decision. It was rough for a bit, right? I, I was a little afraid. Missing no could just bone me. But it seems to be going out in my favor and give me the synergies I was hoping for. We got a small rock though? Okay, hold on. Thank you. Uh, this will get rolled next floor, but again, like I said, more the merrier. Speed down won't even affect us for too long. I'm having a grand time with this character for real, genuinely. Like, I, I love trying out new characters, figuring out playstyles, and just seeing new synergies. It's so much fun because it's always, always, always a new thing for me. Uh, you guys gotta remember, when I did my initial Dead God, right, like not on YouTube, I was just playing Isaac. I, I never played with mods on, so I never got to experience these cool characters that a lot of people did. Sword versus mob is gonna be one of those moments, I think, that I was mentioning earlier, where I will just walk up to someone with the Book of Shadows. The sprite is broken, but you just gotta believe me, I'm invincible. Uh, and I'm gonna do way too much damage. We take Polaroid here. I'm afraid of spending health on the dark room. That way, I'm also gonna spend health here. No, I'm not. These items suck. I don't know, could work out for me. I have old bandage right now for my roll, so I, I, I think I'd go for it. Soul of, oh my lord. Well, okay. Oh! Hold on, wait a second, a play to be made. Any more red hearts? No, Polaroid proxy. Ooh! Uh, okay, here's here's what I do. Boom, uh, I take Guppy. Just, uh, wait, why would I ever take Guppy? What am I doing? I just lost, all, whatever. Do I do it again? Sure? That, that was definitely less worth it. Okay, well, thanks for this guy. That, that was cool. We didn't really lose that much because we got packed, which uh, gave us health back. I lost one heart, whatever. What do we have now? Still nine lives, damage, car, battery, book of shadows. But other than that, nothing too crazy. Basically just damage. Something I did read, by the way, yikes. 
uh, about the character specifically is that the recall, I think, does have a cooldown, but it's not that noticeable only if you have massive tears down. Probably if you find like Polyphemus, right? Otherwise, you can spam it basically as fast as you want. Unidentified. So many. Full health is good. I got my Boneheart healed. Still not found a natural occurring Grim from the Missing No Devil play. Could happen. I'm wondering what Knife does as well. Logically, all that happens is it, it shoots down, right? And then Brimstone shoots out everywhere. That just sounds cool, though. I just want to have a, a, a chance to try it. Okay, did you see the cycle I just did right then? I, I I was a factory worker, ready to go. Everything was in place, ready. That felt kind of sick. Walk into that tier for me. All right, it's the Fallen. I can do the Fallen for sure. Let's just pop Book of Shadows and walk into him. This is the reason I chose Shadows over Belial, right? Guppy, I'm Guppy for real. Nice. And Pentagram. Do I lose a Bone Heart over Pentagram? Bro. I won't. I, I, oh god. I mean, it's gonna get rolled. I'm just gonna leave it. I'll leave it. Whatever. Boom. No brimstone still. Stop watch. Blood Oath has taken away my damage. Or my health, sorry. This vault has things in it. That's typically what vaults have. <laughs> Hey, school bag is cool. Uh, a little bit of a weaker run for this specific build, but not the worst. I can definitely work with this. It's effectively the same thing, just a lot less damage. World is useful very early on. We now know that I will not hit a dead end. I hate this room, definitely. I'm just gonna do semicircle strafes and eventually I'll die though, so it's not the worst. It's terrible if you have low damage though. We're just gonna check this out uh, and then we'll go straight to the boss. I will blow you up and go. Uh, you know, this stone chest looks pretty cool. I'm calling a stapler. Oh my! I was close! By all surprise, I was genuinely really close. Big room means I'm definitely pressing space far here, uh, just because it'll get two charges. It's basically already done. Camo Undies does not seem like it has the best synergy with specifically Glare, right? Because Glare uh, doesn't really get that much benefit from their first shot. It's more just like their shots are good in general. Power Pill is good to know. Power Pill actually heals you from what I remember. This is a fun fact. I feel like people don't know this. It's basically Pac-Man, so I can heal up by doing that. Get a recall going. That was a perfect recall. That felt incredible to do. Okay, the character makes sense to me, and I'm having a ton of fun. I will take my leave once I guess the super secret room one more time. Ha ha ha! Oh my, it's so worth it. What? Goodbye to it lives. You will not live. You will not live. <laughs> Oh, I like seeing the burst go down. Wait, am I taking actual damage? Whoops, I uh, did not realize how long Book of Shadows was going to take. You need to come back to me. The sword took so long. <laughs> oh no, the sword took so long to come back. Oh, what? I, I forgot that I re-roll on every floor. I got, what is this? Uh, tech Zero, right? That's pretty cool. I wonder what our last floor is going to have. That's going to be interesting. That'll basically uh, determine whether or not I'm going to win. Then again, I have been playing pretty decently today. Ow. You guys ever notice that those holy eyes are way too good at tracking your movement? Is that just me? I feel like... <laughs> I feel like I, I, I walk in a direction and then I choose a different direction when they start shooting and they know where I'm going at all times and I'm like, damn, I got mixed. I'm playing rock, paper, scissors with uh, Isaac enemies. It's terrifying. This is even more terrifying. What makes you smile will reduce my hitbox. I like that. We get a battery back so there's no reason not to use book of shadows there this is also another big room i'm just gonna use shadows here death will go bye bye you are not gonna slow me down that is the worst thing uh oh this is a wrong way moment but for some reason honestly going wrong way on cathedral never feels that bad it feels pretty bad on shoal but i don't know maybe i'm alone here but it feels the worst on womb i don't care about like going the wrong way in cathedral maybe i just like the vibe here it's pretty holy <laughs> Okay, that actually does feel kind of bad if you take two wrong turns. I'm, I retract my statement. I didn't think it'd come to this, but I do actually have to bomb for hearts. It's a sad day indeed. It didn't even work out for me. Like, look at that! He knew exactly where I was going! Whoa! I actually got mixed in the Biting of Isaac. That's just not fair. Finally found the boss. A little bit of an unfortunate play. This is a bit of a terrifying room as well. It does not help, by the way, that Book of Shadows graphic is not working. I cannot tell how long Book of Shadows takes for the invulnerability to wear off. I should have that memorized. What's wrong with me? I could say character issue, but instead, I'll take the fall. Skill issue. My fault. Okay, all done. I am going to start the fight with a bomb and then boom, go crazy. 
Maybe I can kill Isaac, or at least get him to third phase before I lose my shadows here. I am assuming it's probably already over. This was definitely one of the harder builds. Hopefully the chest build is a bit better. Some people ask me how to dodge that move, by the way, the, the Cathedral Light Beam move. And some people say that you can just stand in these top left corners. Here's the truth of it. Uh, yes, you can kind of stay in those corners of the opposite side that they're appearing on. But that used to be an exploit up all the way until Afterbirth Plus. Nowadays, uh, sometimes the light beams can genuinely hit you up there. There is no certain way to genuinely dodge it all the time other than just dodging the light beams. Which is better because before it was really brain dead, you just go to the other corner. It's more fun that way, you know? Okay, we persevered. God knows what that word is. Is this my secret room? Could be. It actually is before I go? Hold on. This a tears up. Cool. All right, that was worth it. Just a very quick check. Uh, let's go to the chest then. Dr. Fetus, what? Okay, what happens? Jesus Christ, oh my God. All right, here's, okay. We have dead cat, so we are survivable, right? Definitely. We have also a D100. So, in theory, if things get so bad and we're down to no more lives, I can D100 myself again and maybe live. But this seems like I'm just going to instantly die. I, I don't see my- oh my god. It's definitely cool though! How do I even tackle this? I mean the bombs are way too crazy. Do I just hard commit? Oh my god. I might just die. There you go, at least I got one room done. I feel like I need Book of Shadows ready per room. My speed is terrible! I can't even uh, do anything. If I get sucked in by Mega Fatty, I'm bone. What? He predicted my movement. He's even better than the holy eyes. Where am I? This is this is god awful. Where uh, where am I going? I don't even have access to D100 anymore. Please, no, I can't end like this. I I, I will actually be I'm so embarrassed. Please don't do this to me. No, please. Where am I going? Why are you putting me deeper? I I I I, I, I can't. The doctor fetus is a crazy play. I don't know why you would think this would be good. Don't don't do this to me. Do I make my way back to D100? I feel like it's the only plausible way I could possibly win. Oh, that's cool. Oh god. 